Hi, and welcome to Adding User Management. What we'll cover in this section, introduction to Amazon Cognito, updating your user pool in the AWS console, adding sign-in functionality to the web app, and updating the business logic to store the receipts by user ID. Hi, and welcome to introduction to Amazon Cognito. What we'll cover in this video, what Amazon Cognito is and what it does for you. What are user pools and what are federated identities? What is Amazon Cognito and what does it do for you? Cognito allows you to easily add user sign up and log in or sign in to your apps. We'll add this capability to your app in an upcoming section. Cognito allows you to authenticate your users using multiple identity providers, including Cognito, Twitter, Facebook, Amazon, and others. You can use one or more of these at the same time, making it easy for your users to sign up and sign in. This image shows how Cognito will allow you to share data across multiple devices and keep it synchronized. It will also allow you to save data locally and synchronize that data across multiple devices. You can save scores or status or whatever you want securely across all of the user's devices. What are user pools? Cognito user pools provides your user directory functions, sign up and sign in. This is where your user's data resides if not using other identity providers. It's automatically and infinitely scalable. AWS takes care of scaling automatically. It can automatically validate email and cell phone information. It will send confirmation codes via email or SMS. What are federated identities? Cognito Federated Identities provides the ability to federate or join multiple identity providers like Cognito User Pools, Facebook, Twitter, and others. This makes it much easier for your users to start using your app. It enables your app to allow people to sign up and sign in using their existing social identities and SAML-enabled providers or simple email address. The easier it is for people to sign up for your app, the more people will do it. 